rise for the opening prayer. <clears throat> o Lord, support us all the day long until the shadows lengthen and the evening comes and the busy world is hushed and the fever of life is over and our work is done. Then in thy mercy grant us a saving lodging and a holy rest and peace at last. Deliver us when we draw near to thee from coldness of heart and wanderings of mind, that with steadfast thoughts and kindled affections we may worship thee in spirit and in truth. We beseech thee mercifully to incline thine ear to us, who have now made our prayers and supplications unto thee, and grant that those things which we have faithfully asked according to thy will may effectually be obtained, to the relief of our necessity and to the setting forth of thy glory. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. God save the Queen. God save the Queen. <laughs> we will now be performing a dance for you with musical stylings from. Yes. <laughs> Sweet Eliza built her 
Poet's speech at Her Majesty's departure. O oh, see, sweet Cynthia, how the watery gods, which joyed of late to view thy glorious beams, at this retired do wail and wring their hands, distilling from their eyes salt showers of tears, to bring in winter with their wet lament, for how can summer stay when sun departs? See where Sylvanus sits and sadly mourns. To think that autumn with his withered wings will bring in tempest when thy beams are hence, for how can summer stay when sun departs? See where those graces and those hours of heaven, which at thy coming sung triumphal songs, and smoothed the way and strewed it with sweet flowers, now if they durst would stop it with green boughs. Lest be thine absent in the year's pride decay, for how can summer stay when sun departs? Leaves fall, grass die, beasts in the wood hang head, birds cease to sing, and every creature wails. To see the season alter with this change, how can summer stay when sun departs? Oh, either stay or soon return again, for summer's parting is the country's pain. Thanks, gracious goddess, for thy bounteous largest, whose worth, although it yields us sweet content, yet they depart gives us a great sorrow. Come again, fair nature's treasure, whose looks yield joys exceeding measure. O oh, come again, sweet beauty, sun, when thou art gone, our joys are done. <laughs> now we require that you all join us in this last dance. Please find a partner and follow along. If you would like, you could file behind us. Follow our moves. My man! Mr. Thomas. Mr. Alcohol. I don't know how long it is. Yeah. Oh, there's a little bit. Right. Let's see what's too many. Okay. Are you ready to begin? Yes. Um. Almighty God, 
that the words which we have heard this day with our outward ears may through thy grace be so grafted inwardly in our hearts that they may bring forth in us the fruit of good living to the honor and praise of thy nature. I pray that the queen so thoroughly enjoys the rest of thee performances on the day of such and help guide her counsel to make a wise decision in licensing. Grant the troop with the most talent and precise script through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. 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 Amen.